What's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Red Crimson 102 again. I got for you here the thumbs, thumb, the thumb pad replacement for either the Switch Lite or the Nintendo Switch um, big model, red box model, OLED model. But in this case, I got it for the Switch Lite. Um, my thumbstick came off. I don't know how. But then again, you know, the Switch is Nintendo's most, you know, sturdy, sturdiest console. But anyway, um, of all my years of gaming, I've never really had the thumbstick fall off. I've seen people with the PS Vita back in the days, and even the PSP, where the analog nub would fall off. And I used to wonder, how did that even happen? I guess they've been gaming on it pretty hard, I don't know, but... I always take care of my things, but at the same time, things happen. So I need a replacement. And it felt kind of awkward, really, trying to play games with a thumb pad missing. So I kind of stopped using it in a way. Or rather, not as much. So if anybody's having the same problem, you can actually order these thumb pads, thumb pad replacement off Amazon and this is from the good old boys over at Skull & Co. Skull & Co is a trusted brand, trusted accessory brand. I like their products. I think they're really, really excellent. Um, always work, always dependable. And we're gonna see if putting the thumb pads on today is gonna work. And you can get this for ten dollars on Amazon, or you can order them directly from Skull and Co. I got these on Amazon for ten dollars, pretty cheap. They come in light gray and I believe black. I actually wanted the the pink color because this is the Pokemon Edition Switch that came out some years back, and I was actually looking for the pink color because it's blue and pink or blue and red whatever I couldn't seem to find it so this it goes on pretty easy all you gotta do is pull it I really don't like too much tension on my analog almost on it looks so funny when it's not properly on oh that wasn't bad at all that was actually pretty simple simple but man I can't really stand this light gray color I should have got black but actually black would look even worse I guess I'm not sh sure I can't even visualize a black but I don't know um I did see different color ones on on, on Amazon and eBay some of them were pretty expensive I was not paying 40 50 dollars or better for thumb pad replacement that's just crazy but this is this isn't the original color and it kind of irks me a little bit that it's not the pink color it's supposed to be but at least it's better than nothing on um, it actually feels a lot better now that the thumb pad is on there does it feel the same as the blue one uh, I really can't say there's like a slight difference in feel some people may not notice it but the most important thing is you're not staring at that ugly that ugly knob and it doesn't feel awkward it actually feels good on the finger so i guess i'll take this white color even though it doesn't really match over just that ugly knob how it looked before but yeah guys so that's it I don't want to make this video too long, so anybody having the same issue as mine where your thumb pads are gone due to wear and tear, you can go on Amazon and you could order these, 10 bucks, 
you get uh, six in a pack. Hopefully this one lasts a lot longer because six comes in a pack so I don't know sometimes that tells me this might may fall off just like the original thumb pad that was on there but it could be wrong but I've had this system for a while and I've had this for some years I had this at launch so it does have wear and tear on there and hey I got it fixed so there you go welcome to one or two like and subscribe if you're new to my channel and see you guys next video